welcome back to civil skills academy in this video we will discuss how to create a corridor surface in our previous video we have modeled this corridor by using uh, assembly baseline and alignment and so on to get an idea about how we have created this corridor make sure to watch our previous video and for now before getting started, make sure to subscribe to my channel. Without wasting any time, let's get started. To create a corridor surface, simply select your surface. And from contextual tool, you can see corridor surfaces. Simply click on that and you need to click on create a corridor surface. We click on that and specify a unique name and specify the surface style for now we for data type and specify code we'll just go with the default for links you can also use feature lines as a data type and for default we have top while creating a datum surface you can choose datum for now we are creating a top surface so we'll just go with the top specify the surface style that you want to use click on ok for overhang correction since we are creating a top select top links and click on plus plus icon make sure to uh, turn on this add as a break line so once you're done <clears throat> simply click on ok or if you want to create a new surface you can create a new surface as well. If you want to create a datum surface, you can create that as well. Specify surface style. For now, just go with, we'll go with no display. So click on OK. Specify datum plus icon, bottom links, datum, and turn on add as a break line so once you are done providing the data simply click on apply click on ok as you can see surface has been created and to add a surface boundary it is better to add a surface boundary if once if you are calculating earthwork for your corridor so as you can see these surface contours are extending way beyond your corridors and to add a boundary simply go to corridor surfaces and boundaries select right click corridor extends as outer boundary is the best option for now simply click outer boundary and now simply click on apply rebuild the corridor click on ok as you can see surface has now been limited to your corridor boundary as you can see yeah so this is how you can add a boundary to your corridor surface now to get a better understanding or to study the surface simply you can use the object viewer Can zoom in zoom out select a different style yeah so this is how you can create a corridor surface I hope you understood the video. If you like it, make sure to hit the like and subscribe button. 
and to see such similar videos make sure to turn on that bell icon notification uh, so we'll meet again in the new video thank you for watching